Hi, my name is Given Campbell. I'm a wallpaper designer in Tampa, Florida, and today I'm going to give you tips on how to remove wallpaper from drywall. The one thing that you should keep in mind is that when you glue wallpaper directly to drywall, you're essentially gluing two pieces of paper together because drywall has the paper on the outside. So the one thing that you need to remember is to go slowly. Um, you want to first score it with some kind of a cutting tool. A claw works really well. It's just a handheld plastic tool that has cutting blades on the underside. You move it across the wall in a sweeping circular motion. Once you've done that, you apply a wallpaper stripper. You can also use a propane powered steamer and you can rent these at most home improvement stores. You, once you get the wallpaper stripper on, you can apply it with a sponge or with a spray bottle. Um, but you want to wait about 15 minutes and let it soak in. Once that's done, the paper will start to bubble. So you'll start to see, you know, evidence that the wallpaper's coming up. And you want to start slowly. Just grab one corner. It doesn't really matter which. You just want to find the path of least resistance. Start to pull. And if any areas begin to, um, to not, like if the paper won't come up on certain areas, you should wait, don't force it because you can actually tear the front covering off of the drywall along with the paper and then you may actually have to remove the drywall and have it reinstalled. So you're going to end up costing yourself more money and you're going to have to take more time to get your project finished. So the key is going slow and the other key is to use hot, hot water. As hot as you can take it when you mix your, you either dilute or if you mix up